Good morning, Royal Woods Middle School. How's it hopping, kangaroos? Today, we have an exciting action news special planned for you that you definitely won't want to miss. We'll be looking at highlights from the sporting career of our eighth grade class's very own MVP, Lynn Loud. But first, here are today's top stories. Clyde? A large chili spill has closed down the southeast hallway, causing major backups throughout the school. I would advise taking the main hallway by the photo lab to avoid the traffic. Lincoln? This week, Mr. Bull Huffner is celebrating his 10th anniversary at Royal Woods Middle School. When asked for a comment, he said, and I quote, Go away! Can't you see I'm trying to eat my microwave trout? Truly an inspiration to us all. Indeed. And now for our Action News Team Special. From an early age, Lynn Loud Jr. was a champion. Her life has always been centered around sports. She could skate long before she could walk and sing her favorite team's cheers before she could even talk. Her love of sports is rivaled only by her love of meatball subs. Of her countless accomplishments, she's probably proudest of being the youngest athlete to win a flibber. Gesundheit. Thanks, Clyde, but a flibber is actually a championship win in football, lacrosse, ice hockey, baseball, basketball, and roller derby. Right, uh, I knew that. And so today we're celebrating Lynn Loud as a teammate, a coach, a competitor, and a superstitious star. I know we rehearsed that, but it gets me every time. Thanks, buddy. Wanna kick off the show with a clip? You know it. Lynn asked me to make sure I showed a classic LJ goat moment. So here's the best one I could find. Uh, there they yeah. go, there they go! Bad pitcher. Bad pitcher. Uh, Clyde, I think she meant goat as in greatest of all time. Ah, well, in that case, I need to make a quick call to Liam's farm and cancel Carol Ann's surprise appearance. Carol Ann the goat, as in goat, not as in the goat. <laughs> well, it certainly takes a team to run that farm, just like it takes a team to win a championship game. Speaking of, here are some of the best moments of Lynn as a teammate. Quadruple teamed? Are you kidding? Take the shot, Marco! Uh. Uh, Marco! I... I can't believe it! That was incredible! Marco! 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 Nice try, Amy. You almost had it! Diane dribbles up court, passes to Maya, who takes a shot! Oh, it's rolling around! Ooh, Paula taps it in from below. Ah, oh, crutch play, Paula. Diane and Amy run the ball up court. Amy, I'm open, I'm open. She passes it to Lynn. Lynn loud with the ball, Allie! Ooh! The turkeys are really hustling out there. But will it be enough, Pep? Will it be enough? Ooh, don't spoil it for me. Lynn's got the ball. Maya, catch! Maya's got it. Ooh. Getting sleepy there, making herself comfortable. Maya, wake up! Clock's running out! <laughs> Maya wakes up! Maya's on the move, but the free throwers are on her. And with time running out, the jerky's gotta make a move. of victory. Yeah, great win, guys. Should we go celebrate at the Burpin Burger? Blue 22! Blue 22! Hut, hut! I would have preferred a victory pack to my posterior. Wow, what a goal. Or basket? What a hoop? Sorry, antiquing with my dad's is the closest I get to organized sports. Also, where did we get all this great footage? All of today's footage has been provided by Lisa Loud. She has cameras everywhere, but she promised me they're not always recording. How many more orders do we have to make for tomorrow? 10 orders for a total of 15 dozen cookies, which will take, um... Lisa? 60 hours or 2.5 days, and that's with no potty breaks. You were listening? How? I'm at Clyde's house. Your surveillance measures have gone too far. 
I heard it through your walkie-talkie, you boob. <laughs> oh, well, thank you. You're welcome. Here's another tip. Hire employees. If two nincompoops can make a dozen cookies in four hours, think how many cookies six or seven nincompoops could make in that time. Hey! One last tip. Maybe look for a bigger workspace. How do you know the layout of my kitchen? Be gotta go. I believe her. I think. While we check the newsroom for hidden cameras, enjoy these great Coach Lynn clips. Okay, now just pretend like you're throwing a cow pie and aim for that egg. That's the magic strike zone. Ugh. Ooh. Your speed is incredible, but your control could use some work. Well, baseballs feel mighty different than cow pies. And they sure do smell better. Ugh. More to the left. Uh, more to the right. <sighs> Don't think so much. Just pitch. <sighs> oh, <laughs> welcome to the team, cow pie kid. Whoa! A celebration like this calls for a pig pile. <laughs> <Whoa -hoo! laughs> Ninth inning and things are not looking good for the Royal Woods Kangaroos. They are down eight to one against the Hazel Tucky Hawkers. Quiet, chump. You got this, Margo. <laughs> mm. Hey, you still gotta pay for that. <laughs> what do you kangaroos owes me big? That's ball four. Oh, time, time. All right, you're done, kid. Time to bench it. Paula, look alive! You're pitching! Team captain Lynn Loud is making her fifth pitching change. <laughs> that ball is out of here! Oh. Ah, oh, come on! When I blow the whistle, you guys run to the center of the ring and wrestle! Guys, Lucha Libra is a contact sport. This time, Caleb, you bounce off the ropes and come back at Camille with an angry possum. Like so. Ah! I'm stuck! I guess you guys aren't ready for wrestling yet. Because <sighs> first you have to get into shape. Your parents have a serious lack of exercise equipment, so we'll have to improvise. Camille, let's do some curls with these kosher dills. That's totally normal. Walk it off. <laughs> okay, Caleb, your turn. Let's see you deadlift this turkey. Oh. Important lesson for you guys. After a good workout, you always want to replenish those proteins. Ooh, eggs. May I please have scrambled? I like mine hard boiled. Eh. Cooking takes too long. Your body needs that protein now. <laughs> Uh, don't show weakness. It will just make things worse. You forget that you've got a secret weapon. Me. I'll teach you everything you need to know about football. Um. Good. Now drop and give me 20. I've only got a five. really leaves you with a mark, and sometimes a bruise, and maybe a twisted ankle. Anyway, let's check in with Clyde as he gets ready for our next segment. Clyde, can you hear me? 
Loud and clear, buddy. I'm on my way now to the... Oh, no! I forgot about the jelly spill! Uh, Clyde, are you okay? There's jelly everywhere! While I check on Clyde, let's take a break. We'll be right back. Welcome back, kangaroos. We now go live to the Burp and Burger, where Clyde McBride is on the scene. Clyde? After an extensive chili cleanup, testing the limits of my stain removal kit, I'm standing here at the Burp and Burger, where they're about to unveil a new menu item <laughs> named after Lynn. What's it called? The Linner Linner Double Burger Dinner. It's a standard double belcher with extra pickles, extra onions, and triple Diablo sauce. Let's try this bad boy out. Mm. Wait, mm -hmm. did you say triple Diablo sauce? That sounds intense. Yeah, you can hardly taste it, though. Oh, wait, there it is. <laughs> oh, that looks like it hurts. Well, while Clyde battles that burger, here's a few highlights of Lynn as a battle-ready competitor. Ow, ow, ow! I can chug faster than you. Uh. I win in your face, Milkin. Woo! Racing to the top. Ow! Woo I win. Oh, you went down hard. I thought I was going up. Yes! I win. I stacked more blocks than you. Explosion first. I wasn't trying to make an explosion. Dang it. I can wash faster than you. I can rush faster than you. I can go to sleep the fastest. Uh, I can also snore the loudest. <laughs> Alright, time to scout myself a date. Let's see who can keep up with Lynn Loud. Forget this. There's no way we could beat her. Huh. Guess I gotta try something else. Oh, oh come on, man. Were you even trying? Ugh, I'm sorry. They're just, like, really, really strong. Thanks. I never skip arm day. Okay, well, this isn't working. Time to change up my strategy. <laughs> Basket. Ball. Don't do it! Don't do it! Two points, 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 two points! Yeah! Bye-bye! My favorite exercise is rock climbing. It's a great way to get in shape and a total head rush. Oh, let's do this! Uh, 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 land loud, land loud, land loud, land loud! Uh, are we in shape yet? Get her! Check it out! This band moves like a penguin! Give it up for the penguin! Salmon. Yes! I win! Ah! Losers clean up! How are you feeling, Clyde? Once my taste buds healed, much better. Think you're up for our new segment? Let's do it. It's time for the Action News Team Playbook, <laughs> where we break down and analyze great sporting moments. I'm still Lincoln Loud. And I'm still Clyde McBride. Roll it! Oh, would you look at the time? Let's just turn in and get this night over with. What do you mean? It's still early and you have a fun new roommate. Yeah, luce libre. I can't see anything. Now walk us through what we're seeing here, Lincoln. Well, Clyde, to be honest, I couldn't see much of anything in that mask. All I knew was that in that moment, I was in trouble. 
Lunatic win off the third turn buckle. What? What? I can't hear anything either. Uh, Ooh, that one must have oh. hurt. You oh. have no idea. But look at that four. Now that's a proper flying elbow from the top rope. Oh! 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 oh. See, that's a wall suplex into an elbow drop. Now, how does the elbow drop feel in comparison to the flying elbow drop? Very similar, Clyde. Very similar. Well, we thank you for your insight. What an athlete. This has been the, the Action, Action News Team, Team Playbook. Playbook. I was lucky to make it out of that match alive. And speaking of luck, let's turn the spotlight on some of Lynn's wildest sports superstitions. It reeks of hot jellyfish in here. It's good luck for the team. Bring the sting! Bring the sting! Bring the sting! It's good luck for the team. Lori, get up there with our mascot and do the wiggle. Please don't make me do this. <laughs> it's good luck for the team. Ah, uh, you ready, honey? Hup, hup, not yet. Hup, hup, hup. Okay, now I'm ready. Wow, honey, I know you always have your superstitious rituals before a trial, but they seem more intense than usual today. Can't take any chances. It's for my flibber. Your what? Well, it's a beautiful day at the park, isn't it, Pep? Oh, sure it is. It's the bottom of the ninth with the Royal Wood Squirrels up three nothing. Could this be another shutout for star pitcher Lynn Loud? <laughs> Loud is performing her signature good luck rituals. Hut the hook, hut the hook, hut the hook. Hey, Pep, you believe there's anything to these kinds of superstitions? I don't know. Well, here's the windup and the pitch. Ooh, looks like the softball gods did not love that Cossack dance. What's up, my tentacle troopers? Woohoo! How you gonna do me dirty like that on game day, Fern? <laughs> They call her Stern Fern. She's the most feared usher in the league. One time, she kicked out the mascot for sneezing too loud. Fern takes this hockey stuff way too seriously. <gasps> Luann, no! You can't sit like that! Pretzel style only on game days. It's good luck. You two pops, crisscross applesauce. Ow, 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 ow. If I'd known, I would have done some pre-game stretches. Looks like this pretzel's a little salty. <laughs> hot dogs, funnel cakes. Get your hot dogs and funnel cakes. Ah, the reason I'm here. I stop. You can't order food from him. He's a mush. Bad luck. Hey, Vicky. Let me get two porksters and a couple of doughboys, goofy foot style. That's your standard hot dog with powdered sugar and funnel cake with mustard. It's good luck for the team. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Rowdy McQuads is on a breakaway! <laughs> he put the biscuit in the basket! See, uh, I told you these were lucky. Uh, ah, tastes like luck. Okay, second period is starting. Time to change. Change? Yeah, I have a first period jersey, a second period jersey, and a third period jersey. Now get in! Ah! <gasps> Do you have any superstitions, Clyde? I always keep a lucky handkerchief with me wherever I go. Ooh, can we see it? Sure. It's right. Uh-oh. Where did it go? While we look for Clyde's missing handkerchief, we'll be right back. Funky Pigeon's Pizza Palooza Paradise! Starring your favorite video games, your favorite toppings, and your favorite hits. Ooh, girl, if I could. Ooh, girl. Ooh, girl. Give me the world, girl. Funky Pigeon's Pizza Palooza Paradise! You'll lose your mind! Welcome back, kangaroos. <laughs> what a broadcast. We found your lucky handkerchief, cleaned a massive traffic-stopping chili spill, and tried Lynn's new burger all in one show. Never a dull moment for the Action News team. Before we say goodbye, there's one last thing we want to show you. No sports special is complete without a few bloopers, so here are some totally wacky ones featuring Lynn and some of my other family members. Enjoy. Oh, oh, come on! Who was supposed to be covering my blind side? Hey, I'm doing it! Give it a try, Clyde! Here I go! Ah! 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 Ah!
Good luck for the team. 57, 58, 59. Ouch! Right by the boom? That pole. Right! The pole! <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Take a mulligan. Try again. We'll call that a warm-up shot. my game today. Oh, don't worry about it, champ. Just keep a cool head. Ending well. I think I got something! Reel it in! That's our lunch! Well, the important thing is, we caught one. Yeah, and we still have our sandwiches for lunch. Now gently rock forward as we go into Kropo. <laughs> Well, that about does it. Thanks for watching. From all of us here at Action News, have a hoppy day, kangaroos. <laughs> <laughs>